guys. Hey guys, and welcome to the Chroma side of YouTube. So, what do we got going on here? Well, I have seen silhouette swipes, and I love them. I think they're amazing. I think they have such an impact that I wanted to try one in my own quirky kind of way. So, what did I do? I found this picture of a silhouette. It was an advertisement in a magazine. And I am going to swipe her back and hopefully have her silhouette on the swipe. How am I going to swipe the color back and keep it just at this silhouette? Well, I found these cute little um, squeeze bottles on Wish. And they're just teeny tiny squeeze bottles. And they have um, the paints that I'm going, the colors that I'm going to use in them. And I'm going to use these accurate little tips here to put the paint along the side of her silhouette and drag back. Now, I'm going to flood my canvas with this. This is actually a mixture. I, I ran out of white paint, guys. <laughs> so I did Naples Yellow. I did uh, Iridescent Medium. And I did um, Master's Touch White just to kind of lighten it up. So it kind of brought it to kind of an unbleached titanium color, which I am okay with. So I'm going to go ahead and get started because I'm really excited for this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uncap my little bottles here. These are all leftover paints from a Vallejo acrylic um, pour that I just did with PVC pipes. They are Phthalo Cyan, Prussian Blue, Cyan Blue, Teal, and Ultramarine Blue. Yes. Anyway, so let's get to pouring. And I do have my large palette knife. So I'm just going to flood my canvas with my, my base color. There is no silicone in this. I did one part paint and then I did two parts um, gloss fluid medium by Vallejo because it is very watery and I did not have to add any water to this. Now, put that down in there. I'm going to torch some of these air bubbles out. I see a lot of them. Now I'm going to move the paint so that I know that it's covering the edges. I do want this cover covering this color covering all of my edges because if in fact it does not pour off where the where the um, swipe doesn't happen uh, I want color on the canvas sides yes <laughs> gosh okay where the swipe doesn't run off, I want color on that side, those sides of the canvas. So I am getting all of the air bubbles out of this. There is no silicone, so I don't have to worry about that. Now, let me pull you guys out a little bit so you guys can see. Here she is. And I am just going to, on the edges, and I'm making sure that I'm getting my color on the edges of her. 
so that I do get, in fact, get that shape. I'm not being too uh, specific about where the color, what color goes where. Um, I'm just getting it on the edge. And I'm going to move some of these colors, not really specifically going in any order. Oh no, I didn't want that to happen on there. Okay, I'll turn it around. Okay. So I'm going to turn the canvas around because I got that blue dot in there. And I want the swipe to go that way. Alright. Gingerly lay it down and swipe. Well, that didn't do what I wanted it to do. Let's try again. And I'm just going to lay it down. And now I'll swipe. That's kind of cool. So, now, I'm going to take my teeny tiny palette knife that I have here. Let me get me a napkin. Clean it up with. I had it sitting in my uh, bucket of water here. That's pretty cool. Um, not really digging how chunky her face looks right now. So I'm gonna go through and try to fix it. And I don't want this little dot in here, so I'm just going to remove that guy.
So she changed form a little bit. <laughs> I actually do kind of like this. Uh, what I'll end up doing, let's see if I can do it with this. So I added hair and I'm not digging it. <laughs> I tried, I don't like it. So I'm gonna actually just take her face and swipe that out because I really just don't like that. That actually kind of looks better than what it was. Um, I noticed that some of the paint did not transfer from, well, I scraped too hard. That's what it is. Uh, yeah, that's it. I scraped too hard. So I could see canvas and I don't like that. So what I do, I added some more paint. All right, and I think I'm going to leave this one alone. Um, I do like it. Uh, it's not exactly what I was going for, but it'll do. Well, there you have it. I have a silhouette. Um, the silhouette did end up being a little chunkier than I anticipated and it kind of looks like it's got this uh, 
Donald Trump pout to it, but that's okay because what I'll do um, later is if I really wanted to, I could put the silhouette back here, trace it, and fill all this in with black and that would or white um and that would work out just fine um i actually do kind of like this though it's a little more artistic it's not as perfect uh if you guys like what i do please give me a thumbs up hit subscribe and ring the bell for notifications whenever i put up new videos if you ever want to get in touch with me please feel free to email me at chromastormarts at gmail.com and if you ever want to check me out on my website it's www.chromastormarts1.com as always it's always a pleasure to paint with you all and experiment with you all and i hope that you guys had a great time because i sure did and please Remember, always, always, always keep experimenting and be inspired. Have a great afternoon. Bye-bye, y'all.